So welcome to another video. I was checking out my Instagram one day and I saw this ramp under a bridge and I knew immediately where the bridge was and I was shocked to find there was a ramp there. So this has sparked a do-it-yourself interest in me, which I already have, but now I actually think I have the motivation to do so. But anyways, let's check this ramp out. As you can see, the weather is awful and has been for a while. So here we have Thomas. Welcome. Thomas is the builder of the ramp. This is my mini ramp I moved here about a week ago. And uh, for the rainy season. See how long it lasts before it either gets destroyed by the city or burnt down by hobos? One of the two, yeah. Yeah. We're open for a good winter season. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Got yeah. a line on it? Yeah, I'll put it on something. Thomas is ramp, so he's got the skills on this thing. I'm trying to figure it out still. Okay, yeah. Show us what you got. This is gonna take some practice. So Thomas can actually skate this thing back and forth. <laughs> That's too hard for me. I'm just gonna do coping dancing straight back and forth. Vortex! <laughs> it's the only way out. <laughs> Try and do a pivot fakey. They're sort of my nemesis. Warm up.
Richie. <laughs> okay, guys, so here's what I'm thinking. I want to build, right where I'm sitting, a really nice concrete ledge. Because nobody really likes a metal ledge. I do. Shut up. Okay, maybe that guy does. But I don't like a metal ledge. I like a concrete ledge. And I want to build a really nice concrete ledge. So we're not talking a couple cinder blocks and then a like, couple inches of concrete on there that's just bag concrete that's going to blow apart. I've got an idea for a really nice long-term concrete ledge that could probably get a good 15 to 20 years out of it. Longer than the asphalt in this park anyways. I've got a design for this and I'm going to build it in the next couple of months and I'm just putting the call out. If anyone wants to donate a little bit on the GoFundMe, you know what? Five bucks will get you a bag of concrete. So I need some forming lumber, plywood and two by fours. I'm gonna need to rent some tools to pour the concrete and just generally help out. So I'd figure the project is probably pretty easily gonna cost me about 500 bucks to do a really good job. So anything in that direction will be a huge help. And I think I'll probably have it out before the end of October, if not a bit sooner. If you guys are interested, you can pitch into that. I'm gonna do it anyways because I want a ledge and this place is lit and it's the winter and it's getting dark. So I've got plans for a ledge that I can take to some undergrounds, which is a different video. And I've got plans for this ledge that I can come skate at night when it gets dark out after my kids are in bed. Because one must be resourceful. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. It was a fun little session with Thomas under the ramp there. You'll probably be seeing him again when we build this ledge. So thanks for watching. I hope this gives you a little Saturday morning stoke. Anyways, have a good one, you guys.